Hey y'all, let's get into it. According to a recent survey by the Angus Reid Institute, Canadians still hold competing views of gender definition, womanhood, and transgender issues. The survey of 3,016 Canadian adults found that one of the questions dividing Canadians is, who is considered a woman? The largest share of respondents at 35% said a woman is anyone who identifies that way. Another 34% said a woman is someone who was born anatomically female. And 18% said they would consider someone who has undergone gender affirming surgery a woman. Now moving on to the topic of trans children. In late August, the government of Saskatchewan joined New Brunswick in adopting new gender and pronoun policies for schools. This means that parental consent would be required for students who wish to change their preferred name or pronouns. According to the survey, most Canadians agreed that parents should at least be informed of their child's decision. However, they were divided on the idea of whether or not a parent should have to consent to it. Angus Reid asked Canadians, if you had a child who was showing affinity for a gender other than the gender of their birth, how would you respond? 69% said they would accept it and work with their child to make the process more comfortable. 12% said they would resist the behavior, while 9% said they would reject it outright. So we've come to the end of the story, but not the end of the conversation. Let's continue the conversation down below in the comment section. Tell me, what are your thoughts on society's support of the transgender community and views on gender definition? That's my time. Thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you in the next one. Peace.